northeast which has seen unrest and violence over decades is finally witnessing peace with insurgency on the decline and development taking prominence in this regard the peace accord between the center and the assam government and eight tribal insurgent outfits of the state on september 15 2022 becomes important these outfits are birsa commando force adivasi people's army all adivasi national liberation army adivasi copra military of assam santhali tiger force and three splinter groups of bcf acma and aanla speaking on the occasion union home minister amit shah said that the center was working towards ending all border disputes in the northeast by 2024 Notably, the latest development has taken place 10 years after the center and the tribal outfits signed a ceasefire agreement in 2012. Earlier, Assam and Arunachal governments on July 15, 2022 had signed the Namsai Declaration to end the interstate border conflict by this year. In March 2022, Assam and Meghalaya had signed a pact to resolve 50 year old border dispute Also on September 14 2022 Isap Muiva led National Socialist Council of Nagaland and seven Naga groups under the umbrella of the Forum for Naga Reconciliation met Home Minister Amit Shah to overcome differences over the ongoing peace process Thus various initiatives by the government has led to a major decline in insurgency in the northeast according to the home ministry data since 2014 insurgency in the northeast has come down by 74% and civilian deaths have decreased by 89% moreover in 2020 insurgency related violence declined by 42% in arunachal pradesh 23% in manipur 45% in Nagaland and 12% in Assam as compared to 2019 also in 2020 about 2644 cadres of insurgent groups of the northeastern states surrendered and joined the mainstream Importantly in a step to make Northeast insurgency free the historic Karbi Anglong agreement was signed in September 2021 and in August 2015 a historic peace deal with Naga insurgents was also signed in New Delhi along with these since 2014 road rail and air connectivity in the entire northeast has been improved under the Modi government This is huge as many parts of the northeast states were not connected with railways before 